Good afternoon, everyone. This is Christian with PerfectStockAlert.com. Yesterday, we mentioned that, uh, well, let's see, today is Wednesday, February 24th. So on the 23rd, we mentioned after the sell-off that there was potential for it to bounce back up today and try and shake that selling off. Uh, basically, we said that because that we knew the Fed was going to speak, and if they didn't say anything all that drastic, uh, it would be likely they'd be more apt to speak in such a way as to inspire investors, and that's basically what they did. And we did get that bounce today. But if you pull up my uh, personal chart on the on the Dow Jones Industrial Average, you will notice that uh, we still have this bounce that we've had today still did not break out of this uh, potential downtrend we're forming right here. These uh, two high points right here, here and here. Draw a line between those two. Start to show a, a downtrend that could be developing here. Now we're finding support on this uh, 50 EMA which is also just to top this previous little uh, resistance point. So that's all normal. And what it looks like we're doing here is just a little flag pattern. Let me see if I can draw one on this. This is going to work. We just kind of look. No, it's not going to do it. Yeah, there it is. All right. We're seeing a little flag pattern start to form here. So this could, you know, keep doing this, tightening up a little more and more for the next couple of days before attempting to move higher or it could just break down. In any event, we've not seen through any of these days here, through any of these days, there was no uh, smart money accumulation. They didn't buy into this rally, and they didn't do it yesterday, the day before, and they didn't do it today. We came in at 04 on our MPT reading, which is our wild card. It's also, uh, we've seen that trade flat. So right now, we're just kind of trading flat right in this little area here. That's normal. But again, as I've been pointing out for the past couple of days, once their slow stock gets up here to the over, uh, short term overbought, which we're at now, the odds of the trade switch to a bearish move. You expect it to pull back. And that's what we're waiting for here. So if you're long this market, understand that you are betting against the odds. That's just how that is played. You will notice today we only have one new alert for you on our free side. That's uh, ticker symbol NED. You're going to have fewer and fewer uh, potential alerts coming out as the market weakens. That's normal. Just let that happen. Uh, if you're getting stopped out of your trades, let that happen. The market's trying to tell you that it's weak, and that's what we're trying to tell you as well. So we're looking for a pullback. I would personally like to see a little bounce up here higher. I don't want to see it with nice consolidation because that would create a whole different trade there. Um, so we're just going to kind of watch this market, see what happens. But all in all, I'm still bearish because of this here. And uh, we have resistance line here if this doesn't break out. So let's keep an eye on it. Notice that your volume is pretty weak. It's weakening until you had a sell side, which was yesterday, this sell volume. So I'm going to be watching this market, but I'm sticking to my uh, bear camp for now. Again, follow the indicators. If you want to join us for Monday, starting Monday, we're going to start trading that uh, uh, 2K challenge where I'm going to turn $2,000 portfolio into $1 million right in front of you. We'll do that for all of our full access members. So if you're not a full access member but you want to be one, go to our website, sign up, pay the $145 a year, and we will see you Monday morning.